Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm just putting some earrings in. It is currently the 2nd of January. I'm gonna really struggle to do this. Um, and I am actually doing Veganuary this year. I did it in my first year of uni, so that was three years ago. And I feel like maybe I did it last year as well, but I'm not entirely sure if that's true or if I'm just completely making that up. Um, but anyway, I'm doing Veganuary this year and today I've got the day off work so I thought that I would film a what I eat in a day video. I was going to do just like a everyday vlog but I'm not actually doing a lot today so I thought it would be more beneficial for you guys and just a bit more interesting if I just filmed what I've eaten. So the time is just coming up to 10 o'clock. I've been getting ready this morning. I've had a coffee already. That's always the first thing I do in the morning. So I made a coffee this morning morning with my Oatly Barista Oat Milk which is my favourite and I also added some vanilla syrup from the Skinny Food Company because their syrups are also vegan so that was my morning coffee. I'm actually yet to have breakfast. Um, I've been so busy getting ready and thinking about what I'm going to do today that I completely forgot to have breakfast so that is next on my list. So we're going to go downstairs now, get some breakfast and then I'm going to head to my local Waitrose. I want to pick up some bits for dinner tonight and there's something in Waitrose that I want to try and see if I can find. So as you guys know, I don't really like breakfast. So today I'm going to be having some of the Tesco Free From from Ash Frey. This stuff is so good. It's the apricot flavour and obviously it is vegan. I'm then going to top it with some leftover blueberries and raspberries that need using up because these are super old. Well, this is a new angle of my flat you guys haven't seen before. I'm currently sat on my stairs, don't know why. It's a bit of a boring breakfast to be honest. Um, and then I'm also going to have one of these. These are from Holland and Barrett they are probiotics for your stomach so they've got really good healthy gut bacteria in them and I'm trying to remember to take supplements this month because I don't want to get low on anything chew one to two tablets daily oh I'll have two then oh I'm just gonna eat these before I have my yogurt I'm back. My face is bright red because it's honestly freezing outside. Like I can't feel my hands or my ears. Um, but anyway, I just got back from Waitrose and I thought I would show you guys what I picked up. So first thing I got was this um, Pizza Express vegan pizza. My neighbor just walked past. Pizza Express vegan pizza because it was on offer. It was £2.57 instead of like £5 that it normally is. Um, and I thought one night I can have that for my dinner, so that was good. But I then picked up this because I've never actually seen these in store anywhere. It was like £3.50, yeah, £3.50. But it's the Oatly chocolate fudge ice cream and I couldn't resist getting it because even though I've got vegan ice cream in the freezer, I've never seen that flavour before, so I just picked it up. I got some fruit, I got some golden kiwis, because I, again, I never see those anywhere other than Waitrose, and I love them. Randomly got a carrot. Um, I then picked up two lots of tea, which don't really relate to a vegan food shop, but I saw them and wanted to get them, because I've been really into herbal teas at the moment. I don't know why I feel like they make me feel healthy so I've been drinking them. So I got a Clipper organic raspberry leaf infusion. I don't really know what it's good for but it looked nice. And I also got some Earl Grey tea bags because I like Earl Grey tea and I haven't had it in so long. I also picked up some reduced blueberries. I don't know what the date on them is but 2nd of January, okay today. But I don't really look at the date on fruit anyway and instead of £2 they were £1.50 so I got those. I also picked up some vegan cheese. I got the Applewood vegan smoky cheese because this stuff is insane. I have already got the Via Life Epic Mature, which is also really nice, but I fancied getting that one as well. I got some chili powder because I'm making a chili this evening. I then got some elderflower cordial, which in hindsight was quite heavy to carry home, but I wanted some to make some gin cocktails with. And last but not least, I got some vegan mints because I've got corn mints in the freezer, but obviously that isn't vegan because so it's got egg in it, so picked up this. I am the worst vlogger ever. Um, I've had my lunch. I completely forgot that I was filming this video. I had a sandwich for lunch. The crusts are still on the floor. I literally ate that like over an hour ago and I've just had a nap on the sofa and I've woken up and my neck feels really funny. I knew I shouldn't have vlogged today. I've just picked the wrong day to try and document anything because my brain is just not working. I had a corn vegan chicken, mayonnaise, like vegan mayo and rocket sandwich and it was really nice but like I said I literally had it like well two hours ago. It's currently two o'clock and I had it at 12 
because I was hungry. So this looks absolutely disgusting. Um, but those kiwis I bought were really, really, really mushy. Um, so that's super annoying because they weren't cheap. But anyway, I've put one in a bowl. I don't even know if it's going to taste nice. It's honestly so mushy. And I don't know why, because they're really in date. But I got them out of the packet and they were so soft. So I'm going to attempt to eat that. Um, and I've also got a banana chopped up as well as a snack. So yeah, here's the award for the ugliest, uh, most disgusting looking snack ever. So I've gone for some jammy dodgers. You literally get four tiny, tiny little jammy dodgers in here. And these are vegan. So I'm going to sit and have these and watch a bit of YouTube. So I have a remote job where I work from home and work only five hours a week. But the craziest... So it's quite early, but I'm going to start making dinner. Um, so I've just got some olive oil in a frying pan. Basically, I'm going to be making chilli. So these are all the ingredients that I'm going to be using. Um, it's literally really, really simple. I haven't made chilli in ages, though. So I'm going to cut up a red onion. I've got some baked beans, some mints, some chilli powder. I also need to get out some vegan cheese i'm gonna use some of this um epic mature just to grate on the top and actually i'm also going to use up this leftover italian passata which is what i used in my dinner last night when i had pasta i'm just softening my onions and garlic and i'm going to add in some of this waitrose vegan soya mints everything is now in the chili i've put a teaspoon of chili powder in um but this one doesn't actually say whether it's like mild or strong chili powder and by the smell of it it's strong i think so it's probably going to be too spicy for me but anyway i'll just deal with it um so yeah the baked beans are in the passata everything is in there i'm basically just going to cook this through until it's like really thick and just tastes cooked I guess um, I'm gonna taste test it in a bit just to see how the spice is but yeah that's my chili pretty much done it literally took seconds okay I've served up the chili um, my nose is already running because I just tasted a little bit of this to check the spice levels and I put way too much chili powder in it so that's going to be really fun for me um i just thought i'd show you before i cover it in cheese but yeah that's my portion and then i've got another portion left here which i'm just going to let cool and then i'll probably pop it in the fridge or in the freezer so i finished my dinner it was actually delicious i really enjoyed it i put some vegan mayo with it just to like make it less spicy because it was ridiculously spicy um i'm now gonna have one of these that i picked up in town earlier they are iron supplements you basically put one in water and it makes like a fizzy drink so i'm gonna have one of those hey everyone so it's a little bit later i've just been watching gilmore girls and i fancy some ice cream so i'm gonna try some of the chocolate fudge ice cream from oatly that i picked up earlier on i'm being lazy and i can't be bothered to get a bowl so i'm just gonna eat it straight out of the tub um but i thought i would try it on camera so you guys can see my reaction That is delicious. You wouldn't really know that that's vegan ice cream. Quite often when you get vegan ice cream, the texture's a bit weird, but the texture of this is exactly the same. Good morning everyone, it's the next day, it's Sunday and I've just prepared my breakfast. So I had a coffee this morning but I thought I really didn't need to include that, you guys know what I have now. Breakfast this morning I've got some of the peach yogurt that I had yesterday, um, I've also chopped up a banana and put that on top and then I'm going to be having some of these again which are the probiotics. Hi, so it's now lunchtime, I've realised I haven't actually shown my face on here today um, but yeah, making some lunch. I've got a bit of a weird one um, but I picked up some wraps, I've just been to the shop and got a few more essentials. So so I picked up some wraps. I've got a whole meal wrap with Rocket and then I used up the leftover corn chicken slices. So they're all gone now with some Rocket and some vegan mayo, which you're actually balancing on. Um, and then I'm going to have on the side some crisps. These are the Sainsbury's Taste the Difference sea salt and cider vinegar. So I'm just going to have like a handful of those on the side. And then I need to eat some of these blueberries that I picked up yesterday because they were reduced because they were like running out of date. So uh yeah i need to eat some of those i'm also having a huge glass of water because i've got a headache today i know it's nothing to do with water i think it's just my hormones but yeah my head's really hurting so lunch water and then i'll eat some blueberries as well I'm having some blueberries after my lunch with one of those kiwis. Again, it was really soft and disgusting like yesterday, but it tastes good. Um, just looks really gross and mushy. So yeah, that is my 
bowl of fruit. Good evening everyone, I'm about to make some dinner um, and I'm gonna have a little bit of a freezer dinner, a bit of a lazy dinner, so I've got some bird's eye potato waffles which I'm pretty sure are vegan. I've then got some bird's eye green cuisine vegan nuggets and then I'm gonna cook up some veg. I'm gonna have some broccoli, some carrot and some peas. I'm just gonna like chop it all up really small and boil it so I will show you that when it's done. So I've just taken my nuggets and potato waffles out of the oven. Um, if <laughs> I've put a little bit of cheese on one of the waffles. Basically, it's a weird thing that my mum used to do when I was a kid. We'd have like potato waffles with cheese on. So I've put some of my Violife Epic Mature cheddar on them. Dinner is served. I'm probably going to have some ketchup with this as well. But yeah, looks really, really good. That is a huge pile of veg. Excuse the messy tray, but I'm having another one of these iron tablet things. They actually taste really good. It basically just tastes like um, orange squash, like weak orange squash. It's not too bad. So it's a little bit later on now. I finished drinking my drink and I think I'm gonna end this video here. One, because my camera battery needs charging and two, I'm literally just going to have a shower, get into some comfy clothes and maybe watch a film or something because tomorrow I'm back to work and I'm working six days this week. So I'm gonna be super busy. So I need to just have a little bit of chill time before that happens so yeah i hope that you enjoyed this vlog i know i was only originally going to film what i eat in a day but i've kind of turned it into what i eat in a weekend let me know if you want to see any more of these videos whilst i'm doing veganuary um but at the end of the month there will be a video coming where i filmed every single dinner for the whole month so that will be coming out at the start of february um but anyway i hope you enjoyed this video please do give it a thumbs up if you did make sure you're subscribed thank you so much for watching i hope you're all doing really well and i will see you guys very soon with another video. Goodbye!